So you want to get Minecraft on your Mac, and I think that's absolutely amazing because Minecraft honestly runs pretty good on Macs, even M1 Macs, it runs pretty good on. And in this video, we're going to show you exactly how to get it. We're even going to mention what version of Minecraft you need, which is Minecraft Java Edition, by the way. It's the only kind of Minecraft that'll work on Mac, how to get that, and then how to download and install it. The first thing you want to do is go to the second link down below, and that's going to take you here. This is our text tutorial on getting Minecraft for Mac, and as you can see, it even does have a little process of how to buy a Minecraft Java Edition, but once you're here, go ahead and click on the green Download a Minecraft button to be taken off to the official Minecraft download page. Now, obviously, it's pretty self-explanatory. You want to go ahead and click Download for Mac OS right here to start downloading. Go ahead and click Allow. It's 100% safe. This is the official Minecraft download page. But before you do that, you do need to make sure you have Minecraft Java Edition. And if you need to purchase it, what you want to do is the same thing. Go to the link in the description. It'll take you here. Still download for Mac OS here. But then what you want to do is come up here to the top, hover over Games, and click on Minecraft. That's then going to take you here, where you want to click on Get Minecraft. And then finally, you'll want to select where you're playing it. Well, you're playing it on a computer, and then you're obviously playing it on Mac, which means you need to get Minecraft Java Edition, because you can see this is for Windows, Linux, and Mac. So when you click on that, it's then going to take you here, where finally you can click Buy Minecraft. You cannot currently use Game Pass on Mac, and so because of that, you need to click Buy Minecraft if you're on Mac. With all that, at that point, it's kind of just going through the purchase process. So just log into your Microsoft account or create one if you don't have one. And sadly, you do need to have one in order to get Minecraft. And then from there, you just kind of purchase it. It's that simple. Nevertheless, though, whenever you finally have Minecraft Java Edition purchased, you come here, you click the download button, which we've already done. Now we can go ahead and minimize Safari here or whatever browser you use. And in our downloads folder, we have Minecraft.dmg. See that? Minecraft.dmg. And go ahead and click on it. And when you click on it, it's going to open up this. We're finally to install Minecraft. Just drag and drop it into the applications folder right here in this pop-up. You can then close out of this kind of Minecraft installer, if you will, and you can remove it from your desktop by dragging and dropping from the top right into the trash icon. You can even delete Minecraft.dmg. Now we can open up Minecraft from our applications folder. Let's go ahead and click on Finder, and then go into Applications, and then we'll be able to scroll down and find Minecraft. Right there it is. Double click on it, and it's going to open up the Minecraft launcher. Now if you do get this, it's saying, hey, you can't open this because we don't know who made this. Well, Microsoft made it, so we're going to go ahead and click OK. It's going to go ahead and allow us to open this up. Now, in my opinion, it should allow us to open that up there, but it's not going to. What we need to do is go down here and go into Settings, and then we need to go to Security and Privacy. Finally, click on General. You might be on this Privacy tab here. Click on General up here at the top, and then you will see right here, Minecraft is blocked from being used because it is not an identified developer. You want to go ahead and click Open anyway. Is then going to go ahead and kind of open this warning? Click Open, and then Hopefully you shouldn't have to do that again. It should just open moving forward. Now it's going to go ahead, update, download, install, and get the Minecraft launcher running. It's going to open up. And from there, we can log into our Microsoft account and play Minecraft. So here we are. The Minecraft launcher is open. Click Microsoft login and log into your Microsoft account right here. So I'm going to do that. Click next, go through the login process, and then we'll play some Minecraft. So we are now logging in. I've just completed the Microsoft sign in. And there we go. We are now in Minecraft. As you can see on the left-hand side, we have Minecraft Java Edition. If you've purchased Minecraft Java Edition under your Xbox or Microsoft account there, you're going to be good. It's going to work. And you just go ahead and click play. You can now open up Minecraft on Mac and enjoy. Like I said, Minecraft honestly runs decently well on Mac. It's kind of impressed me with how good Minecraft does run on Mac. And uh, we're going to have a ton more Minecraft for Mac tutorials coming. So uh, be sure to subscribe for those. So with Minecraft opening, all we have now is a message from our sponsor, which is Apex Minecraft Hosting. Go to the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash apex to get your very own 24-hour Minecraft server. A Minecraft server allows you to play Minecraft with your friends, and Apex is the easiest way to start your very own Minecraft server. We actually love and trust them so much that we host our own server, which we're about to join. Play breakdowncraft.com on them. So check out Apex at the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash apex to get your server up and running. Nevertheless, here we are on the Minecraft main menu. We can go ahead and join the best Minecraft server in the multiverse. Play.breakdowncraft.com Survival, Skyblock, you'll absolutely love it. But nevertheless, thank you so, so much for watching. If you enjoyed, give the video a thumbs up and check out the videos on your screen right now. Specifically, there is a Mac OS tutorials playlist on your screen right now where you can see all the other Minecraft for Mac things you need to know. For example, how do you uh, install resource packs, shaders packs, Optifine mods, all that stuff is covered on Mac OS in that playlist. So go check it out. Nevertheless, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video.